any um any real parent that's going through some shit that really love their kids or whatever will feel the same way will be just as emotional what you talking about you broke a, a, a man window over 20 hours with your son in the car i was just playing bitch and i didn't even break the window and i'm still cool with the dude i was just joking but look at y'all oh y'all bitches be bored in everybody fucking business Just be bored in everybody business thinking you know some shit. Bitch, shut up. You don't know shit. It don't matter. I was just joking. It don't matter what I showed. I was joking. Oh, I hope I supposed to be going this way. Let me. This shit is a lot, but you know what? I ain't about to give up. Every single day, I'm gonna try. Every single day, I'm gonna try to get through at least one day. Oh my god, I'm so jealous. Don't see rolling up right now. I'm gonna try to get through every single day. Thanks, y'all. I appreciate it. <laughs> Right, pretty. I don't be. I, I'm the type. I don't even really care about other people's opinion. That's why I put all my business out there, right? I don't really care. I don't. I'm not easily embarrassed. I don't really care about other people's opinion. A lot of people don't have a lot of confidence in themselves and don't believe in themselves and stuff like that. So they that some shit shit like that will break a person down. Me, not me. I'm from Detroit. Y'all don't even type of family I come from, baby. <laughs> no, only the strong survive. Ooh, shit, I almost ran to the back of this lady. And they almost ran into the back of me. Mm, 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 mm. Okay, big cakes. But it's all right. Everything gonna work out, though. God gonna put me exactly where I'm supposed to be. This bitch jumping out in the middle of traffic. God gonna put me exactly where I'm supposed to be. But I ain't gonna lie. This, this shit is hell. And then, I just, nigga, I chose to have kids, which just make it even worse. Thank you, baby. Thanks for the exclusives. He just makes shit worse. Like, and people don't fully understand because they don't be around. They don't know the history. Just like when that video was put out, that shit was, was made me look bad. When all reality, the police was trying to get y'all try to re screen record me when not y'all so called stab my baby daddy. But in reality, right? Y'all try to screen record and make me look bad. But in re reality, when the shit happened, the police said I wasn't wrong. Go past these lights, then use the right two lanes to keep right to merge onto M59 East towards Utica. Use the right two lanes. Okay, yeah, okay. The police said I wasn't wrong at all. They were trying to lock that nigga up. In about two miles, take to exit 48 to merge onto I-75 South towards Detroit. Oh, um, exit 48. Okay. What is the speed limit? Y'all motherfuckers don't be looking at me like I'm going too slow. <laughs> it's like I can come crowd on your shoulder. Like, I don't even feel like myself right now. Like, I feel like I look a mess, bro. Like... My mama was seeing me yesterday. She said, you look so tired. That's why she kept my baby so that it's easy for me to go to school. So it's easy for me. Oh, shit. Okay, bitch. My mama kept my baby so that it's easy for me to get up and go to school this, this morning. So the commute is easy. When she, she looked at me and she said, baby, you look so fucking tired. She like you ain't. She said, you like you ain't got no sleep in weeks. No sleep, no sleep in weeks. Like you haven't slept in weeks. But I haven't. Dealing with my baby daddy. Because every night that I was around Stay that motherfucker. 48. Hold on. Every night that I was around my motherfucking baby daddy. It was a. Because I already know it was going to be a fight the next morning. 
a fight the next morning because I fell asleep. Fell asleep right putting the baby to sleep. What's up, Tosa? It was always hell. Detroit. That's why I be hopping right on Bigo right before we the fight get too hectic, bitch, because you ain't about to try to do me bold in this motherfucking house. Bitch, 48. Okay, 40, 40, 40, 40 right here. That's why I will always go live, but this motherfucker, bro. Every every morning that uh I wake up and like because I went to sleep early, he'll be trying to fight with me. He want to argue about something, and it always boils down to the fact that I went to sleep after all that he did for the kids. He cooked, he cleaned it, this, this, that, and the other. He'll be mad because I went to sleep. Like you did all you, I did all of this, and then you just go to sleep. Like bitch, what else am I supposed to do at nighttime? I'm not your woman. I'm. What the fuck do you? You think I'm just supposed to be fucking you just because you around me? Just because we in the same household? That don't mean that. I'm not even attracted to my baby daddy sexually. I swear to God, I'm not. 